Sinchino, fine. Normal type? We don't have a normal type. So I can't get a normal type, essentially. Oh! Do we have a poison type? Mm, no. What is Burmy just grass? Is it bug? Is it? I can't remember. Hold on. I think it's just grass. I think it's just grass as well. Um, it it is just bug. 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 Callum. Hello everybody and welcome back to the Pokemon X and Y Soul Link Nuzlocke here with myself Trainer Callum and Will do you want to say hi? I want to say hi hello all welcome back to Trainer Callum's channel in episode 4 of the Soul Link Nuzlocke. I also so, almost said verses. <laughs> <laughs> so, after the disastrous events of the last couple of episodes, um, you'll have seen that uh, Will set this randomizer to give six Pokemon to all of the gym leaders. Um, and not only did he do such a stupid thing, uh, he then <laughs> forgot... And and we didn't find out until we were in the battle. And after the second Mon, a third one came out, and then a fourth one came out. And hang on a minute. Um, I, of <laughs> Today course, I made a mistake. <laughs> <laughs> I, of course, uh, being the uh, incredible Pokemon trainer that I am, won the gym leader battle anyway with all six of the Pokemon uh, because I was well prepared. Uh, Will, on the other hand, did not. Um, so... <laughs> Uh, I have lost many wonderful mons <laughs> whose names are escaping me right now, but I am left with merely a Nummel and a Burmy. Uh, Will, what is your current team? Well, do you want to know something terrifying? What's that? Um, I'm pretty sure the randomizer is all like key trainers, so Professor Sycamore might have six as well. <laughs> Cool. Uh, uh, but my team, we did some grinding. I got level 15, I've got Mistrevious, and I have got Scolopede, or Savior and Randy. And I've done a little bit of thinking, and uh, because Randy knows Defense Curl and Rollout, if you Defense Curl, it boosts, it like gives Rollout more damage. Carvana is the first one out, and I don't think it has a water type move, only dark, which is not very effective against bugs, so I can set up a defense curl and start a rollout, and hopefully that'll just speed through everything. <laughs> I've thought about this this week. Nice. Uh, so, <laughs> I've lost my Zeb Striker, my uh, Durant, Tony Pym, and my Ghastly. Um, while you take on this gym, yeah, how... Just in. Shall I grind for a bit? Shall I move ahead a little bit? Um, uh, grind for a bit, I guess. I have no idea. Because oh, uh, thing is, like, uh, yeah, because like, if, I mean, it should be fine. It's a fully evolved. I hope so. <laughs> bug type with boosted rollout. Um, I should be fine. <laughs> Famous last words. Oh, hang on. Before we start the gym battle, I'm going to do something really brave, and I'm going to put public the first episode, so let's hope this goes well. <laughs> Excellent. <laughs> so, public. Publish. Episode 1 is up on my channel. I don't know why I'm saying this now, because hopefully you would already watched it. <laughs> if not, why are you starting I episode so. 4? What are you doing? Yeah. What's wrong with you? Uh, so I did the other two intro moments I sent to you. I sent the intro moments to Callum on Facebook, but only the third one sent for some reason. Oh, yeah, I only saw one. Ah, I'm very happy with how that third intro moment came out. It's great. I enjoyed it very much. <laughs> I went for one of those you know, Netflix documentaries where it's like, everything was fine <laughs> until it wasn't. <laughs> Negative. <laughs> <laughs> That's what the vibe I was going for. But, okay, right. I'm in. Let's start this. Okay, right. So, defense curl, roll out, hopefully just breeze through. Because Carvana can do nothing to me. I think. I hope. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what's that? 
Defense fell, that's fine. I don't mind that. Roll out, let's go, let's go. Come on, skill of you. Come on, Randy. Almost Oko the Carvana. Stop leering me, please. <laughs> Use a bloody po- actually, yeah. Use your potions on your first mod, right? Please. <laughs> I need to just get through the rest as easily as possible. Okay, Calvana, down. Love that. <laughs> One down! What did I got to the third mon last time? We just have to get past the third mon. <laughs> Why did I do this? <laughs> Right now, yeah, I'm, oh. I'm, um, oh, gone. Uh, Magma, that's a new mon, but also rollout, super effective. Get to heck out of here, Magma. Two Smack down. Smack it. Go. Still haven't seen that Sharpedo yet. Ooh, frames. Frame in L, lad. Okay. Chatot, lovely. Rollout should bop this as well. Chatot is legitimately one of my favorite Pokemon. Really? I love its design. It is just really nice and simple design. And it yeah. has the, what, it has chatter. So it's it has something a, really a aesthetically move. pleasing. And uh, when when Diamond and Pearl came out, um, it was one of the first Pokemon I wanted to get. Because I don't know how familiar you and our viewers here are with the lead up to Generation 4. Um, that was the first... You know, so my first game was yellow, but uh, I was quite yeah. young, got gold like a year later, and crystal, and then ruby and sapphire, I was still quite young. Uh, Diamond and Pearl were the first ones that I was really like following their development online and everything, and um, so, and there was such a long gap between Gens 3 and 4, uh, they revealed a lot of Pokemon early, um, and put them in everything. I mean, it, the main ones were... Lucario, Munchlax, Weavile, Bonsly, and Mime Jr. Uh, I mean, then... I wanted to say, obviously, Lucario is a staple of Gen 4. Uh, God, and absolutely. Then, obviously, the, the new baby mons, other than Happiny, because Happiny can get in the bin. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, and then there were some additional ones when the ninth movie came out, uh, mainly Buizel, Mantike, Manaphy, and, and Chatter. Um, and at the time, as, I mean, because I was I was still kind of youngish at this point, um, I was just so hyped for anything with new Pokemon in it. Um, oh yeah. So spin-offs like Mystery Dungeon featuring some of these Pokemon, uh, Pokemon XD. There was um, uh, like a a lab you could go into where you could do like test battles and you could battle with a Bonsly in it and that kind of stuff like blew my mind because it was like i've never seen this pokemon before it's not in the proper games Callum, yet Callum, Callum, sorry to cut you off it's done we have our first gym hey <laughs> that was nice and quick uh, Nicely defense done. curl rollout worked an absolute treat <laughs> i'm gonna turn down my mic volume a bit because i saw that go into the red just then uh yeah sorry to cut you off yeah <laughs> yeah no not at all um, but yeah, because of all of that and uh, Gen 4's development following it so closely, um, a lot of those Pokemon just became my favourites because I was obsessed with them for so long. Um, and they kept showing up in all these side games and they really like made a thing of them. Um, yeah. So, chat I mean, up. Yeah, what... just a nice design. It's like, right, one of those things where it's always forgotten about. I saw Asteroid Videos uh, did a naming all of the Pokemon. Like, all the way up to Sword and Shield uh, okay. in 24 hours. And I watched that, and it's like, he got 10 off. No, he got 8 off. He got to 890 at 898. Wow. I guarantee you, if um, I was to do that challenge, wouldn't remember chat up at all. That's Completely fair. Completely skipped my mind. Um, all right, uh, should we go get a new encounter, Callum? Yes. So, I've just got... I've just been given EXP share. Lovely. And I I'm think gonna go get some. This is then the next route. Yes, it is. Because you meet left. Dexio and the weirdo. The, I, the, I mean, they're both weird. A Dexio and what's a what's this? What's a face? How many Pokeballs do I have? Five. Oh, that's a good thing more. to check. Yeah, don't did not remember. 
I've got nine, but I will go see if I can get some more anyway. Um, Bruh, my frames are dropping. Jeez. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay, right, I've got 10 potions, 15 Pokeballs, should be fine. Oh yeah, uh, Diamond and Pearl was the last game I played, like, because when I joined second school, we're the same age, aren't we? You're a year above me in uni, but that's because I took a gap year. Um, uh, I took a gap year as well. Are you older than me? Yeah, yeah. Essentially, yeah, nine. I'm going to be 27 in a few months. I'm 27 at the end of the year. Oh, different school years then. Different I guess. school years, I guess. Yeah. Um. But yeah, it's the last because during secondary school, like it was uncool to play Pokemon, and we've got adults oh, yeah. now. Yeah. So Pokemon Diamond was the last one I played. So I've just defeated Cynthia on Brilliant Diamond after like six tries. Like that game, it, it took it up. It took. Yeah, it up. man. Yeah, like, Cynthia. I. I it it's those uh, perfect IV Pokemon she has. Yeah, it's absolutely mad. Like, it took six attempts. So, I was trying to, like, use Pokemon. Like, I didn't want to use a uh, Staraptor. I didn't want to use uh, Lucario. Like, stuff like that. Sure. I ended up with a Luxray on my team. Because I couldn't find a better electric type. Because you can't get Electivire till post game. Which I love yeah. Electivire. Would happily love that. But couldn't get it. Uh,. So, my team was... Are you ready to get the encounter? Uh, yeah, sorry. I just ran into the grass and it's uh, just getting mine now. Um, oh, oh, okay. Cinchino. Fine. Ugh, normal type? We don't have a normal type. That's no. right. So, That's true. the Chino. So, I can't get a normal type, essentially. Or yeah. I just drop all frames. Oh! Do we oh. have a poison type? No. What is Burmy just grass? Is it bug? Is it? I can't. I think it's it. just grass. Let me check. I think it's just grass as well. Um, it it is just bug. So yeah, no poison types. Wait, just bug? Yep. Is Durant bug steel or steel bug? Uh, Durant was steel bug. Because otherwise, we gotta take off a team member. <laughs> uh, I'll have to check. I don't have Durant anymore. Oh, yeah, because I, I died. Because you killed it. <laughs> <laughs> Why would Whoa, you peace. bring that up? Because <laughs> uh, uh, my encounter is a wheezing. Nice. I am afraid. I'm gonna just judge. Does this have self destruct? Because usually the. Oh, goes. I'm in yellow. I'm Normal, this what? was the worst time to get a critical hit. No. I'm sorry, I killed this Roots encounter. I don't think we have another encounter before Sycamore. Right, well. <laughs> if he has six, I'm doing the old defense curl <laughs> roll out. Oh, Frick, my dude. Jesus. Well, it doesn't matter if Weezing has self-destruct then. <laughs> I was just about to look it up. <laughs> I guess uh, it does a little bit. Me. Please don't kill any more of them. <laughs> right, okay. Definitely I still guess... matters a little bit. <sighs> Hell, quite frankly. Okay. Let's see what I could have had. Oh, I wouldn't mind a GD. Critical hits, man. God damn. <laughs> We've only got two mons. Only got two ones. Only got. Uh, so after Sycamore, I'm pretty sure it's like ages to the second gym, isn't it? Uh, I I don't remember. Um, I should remember better. I literally played X and Y. No, it is ages. Because if if you remember, we have to go through the Snorlax and then go all around the cliffs and then go is that down between the, the first and second gym. That is long. This Jesus. one. There's so many encounters, but it's that's long. all right then. Hopefully. Oh, of course, you don't get a critical hit this time, do you, Normal? Part of me was thinking maybe I overtrained it and it would have one shot it anyway, but I have learned against this Cinchino that that is not the case. <laughs> and without that critical hit, I could have killed it. Oh! That's a high dragon! Okay! Uh, 
So, right. Oh my God, this is Cintino, where we talk stop. about. This is where we talk about dragon rage claws. <laughs> yes. So, so, because on the randomizer it says no game breaking moves, occasionally it doesn't work, and nobody knows why. But before oh the God. second jit. Stop, Cintino. Oh, thank God. It's alright, it's fine. Carry on. <laughs> uh, before the second gym, as soon as we get the second gym badge, we can ignore the uh, Dragon Rage Claws is gone. But before the second gym badge, if any of our mons die to Dragon Rage, it doesn't count because the randomizer sometimes doesn't work. So to be this level and having mons with Dragon Rage come at you, very unfair <laughs> that it doesn't work properly. Yeah. So, if we lose them on to Dragon Rage oh uh, my God. before the second gym, it doesn't count. Oh, I got away, it's fine. What? Stop risking it all! Stop playing! I didn't think I, I was know. risking it all! Need to be fair, I've got Level no 12 Nummel that one shot the last Cinchino. I didn't think I'd have an issue fighting another. <laughs> but then it used <gasps> Sing. Oh, Poison Tail, yes. Please, Bibi, give me that. All that yeah. is showing me is that I'm going to be screwed against Sycamore if a random Cinchino can nearly wipe me. <laughs> Poison Sting. Yeah, that doesn't bode well. I hope he doesn't have six mons. I'm not sure if it's like key. If it's just gym leaders, we we can work with that. But if it's all key trainers, like does that include rivals? Because after Sycamore, it's a rival battle. Well, it didn't do that on the first <coughs> rival battle, but that is also the first ah. battle, so. Yeah, maybe that's. By the way, I'm just scurring through this route. Like, I'm not. Yeah, I'm avoiding the trainers and <laughs> things if I can. He said, absolutely skating into the path of someone. A diver who's very far in the water. <sighs> oh, bloody Baldor. What can I do against the Baldor? Nothing. Oh, it's level 7. Okay. To the weird oh, bro, bro, my my very legitimate 3DS is absolutely running like a hamster wheel right now. And the hamster's dead. Jesus. Oh, <laughs> 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 um, right, yeah, back to Brilliant Diamond Shining Pearl. Yeah. Yo! You'll go in next gen games. Callum got his copy of Arceus a couple of days early. <laughs> uh. In two days, I have uh, played 33 hours. I, <laughs> I literally I only stopped uh. playing to come on and record this. <laughs> really? <laughs> I did say I don't really have anything to say because for when Red Dead Redemption 2 came out, I literally booked. I worked at a Layman's Theatre, the Queen's Theatre at this mm. uh, stage, and put in a holiday request. They went, oh, so why do you want it? I was like, Red Dead Redemption 2 comes <laughs> out, and I want to play it. <laughs> that was it. Nice. So, what's it like? Without spoilers, because mine hasn't arrived Of course, yet. of course. Um, Non-spoilers, honestly, I was quite sceptical. Mm -hmm. um, it's absolutely incredible. I mean, the fact that I haven't put it down like, I love Pokemon games, but that is not usually how I am with them. I can take a break, whatever. I have not been able to put this game down. Um, I have beaten the story. Uh, I did that in... To be honest, quite quickly. I did I did decide to rush through the story a little bit and do everything else afterwards. So, story uh, took me about 16, 17 hours. Um, there is a healthy amount of post-game stuff um that kind of also feels like story stuff obviously i won't go into any of what it is um yeah. the closest thing i can relate it to is you know how after sword and shield all the zassian zamazenta stuff the swordward and shield but all of that stuff is after the credits even though it, it feels like it's part of the main game it's it's a similar vibe here there's a good chunk of stuff post credits that's um very relevant to, to the rest of the game. Um, okay. I have done... I think I'm meant to be going to the lab now. Um, I'm, I'm at... 
Um, I forget the name uh, of the city. I'm at Paris. Um, <laughs> uh, Lumios? Lumios City, thank you. Sorry, I'm just getting... My legitimate 3DS is frozen. There it is. Mate, the frames is absolutely... Um, but I think what's most interesting, and again, I won't go into lots and lots of details or anything like that, but um, the battle system is very different. Um, for the better, I think. Um, status conditions work very differently, or at least some of them do. Um... Uh, I don't know how many of the trailers you ended up watching, uh, Will, but I presume literally you're aware of strong it. style and agile style. Yes, those are, that's one of the trailers I saw. I literally not. I said I would watch all the trailers this week. I genuinely haven't had <laughs> <no> time. That's <laughs> fair. Um, but yeah, strong and agile style play a huge part in in the game and how it goes. Um, you don't have to pick between those two. You can do a normal attack if you want. Um, as as it implies, strong style, a uh, lot more power. Um, both strong and agile style use up 2 PP. Um, strong oh, okay. style makes it stronger. Uh, agile style, it's not only faster, it does less power than the attack regularly would. Uh, but there is a chance, depending on the speed of your Pokemon, speed of their Pokemon, all that kind of stuff, there is a chance that you can get to attack twice in a row. Um... It comes up on screen, the order of attacks, and you can see before you select if Agile Style is going to let you attack a second time. can be really useful when catching Pokemon to get an attack in and then also have a turn to throw a ball. Um, all sorts. Uh, it's it's really, really interesting. Okay, I'm about... I, I, I genuinely can't wait. Does I mean, I've just finished Brilliant Diamond, like I said. But to have another Pokemon game back to back. Also, I'm in the lab. I'm not going up to the third floor just yet. I want to wait for you. Uh, for fighting Sycamore. Okay. Uh, where are you little, at? Just got a little cutscene playing outside the lab. Okay, let's go inside. Um, yeah, but to have a Pokemon game back to back. Obviously, that's never happened before. And what was it? Yeah. Ilka did Brilliant Diamond. They outsourced it to Ilka. Um, so it's not like they rushed two games to send them out. They've literally gone, you guys can make a faithful remake. So we don't have to. So and we can work on this big old project. It makes sense. Um, obviously, I won't go into any like plot stuff. But the game does assume that you've played Diamond and Pearl, not in yep. the like, not in any direct way, but it expects you to know what certain places are and what certain things are. Um, yeah. And when those things pop up, it starts to really make sense why they went with a faithful remake. And why they released it so close. I think the intention there was, hey, for people who are now into Pokemon who didn't play the games that came out now, what, 15 years ago. Um, <laughs> yeah, I know. Um, here's, here's a remake so you can experience what everyone experienced. And now here's the game that's set in the same region and will make a bunch of references that you'll get. Yes, um, I'm in the elevator, sense. by the way. Uh, I'm talking to Sycamore. Excellent. Is the second or third floor? A third floor. Um, but god yeah absolutely incredible um, haven't been able to put it down the final final boss fight um, with, a, with a trainer was so effing difficult oh my oh. god um, I had to go away and grind for a while oh my god I, they, see, I like the fact that um, obviously uh, they re-released Brilliant Diamond and Shadow Pearl, and they realised that, like us, 15 years ago we were playing the originals. We're now adults, we want a harder game. Like, let's go, Pikachu and Eevee was very, it was very easy. It was yeah. very, very easy. So at least now they're going, cool, we got that feedback, that was too easy. Let's make a game which older people can enjoy as well. Honestly, yeah, there's some real difficulty, and they've definitely... They must have changed the way a lot of calculation works, both in terms of battle and XP. Yeah. Uh, I'm going to start the Sycamore battle. Speaking cool. of battles. Likewise. Because, cool. um, yeah, Pokemon, like, you know, if in a battle where you're like, your Pokemon's level 40-something and the other's like level 9, 
you shouldn't yeah. have an issue one-shotting it. <laughs> <laughs> All right. It's like uh, it was um, like you yeah, say, brilliant diamond. He has six, six months to beat. Quite frankly, well, the old <laughs> defense girl rollout method. Oh, I, I'm, <laughs> I'm gonna struggle here. I mean, they're all level 10, I think. All his Pokemon should be level 10. What type is Gothita again? Is it just dark? Pure psychic, isn't it? Okay, right. Gen 5 is my, like, big weak spot. That's one of those ones where, because all original Mons, you don't really think about them that much. You're like, I know, the classics that have been in lots of games. <laughs> yeah, literally. Oh god, that was atrocious. Okay, one down, on to second. <laughs> oh, okay, second one has six. Thing is, we get another Mon after this, but because, obviously, you get the starters, which can Mega Evolve in this, yeah. I'm not sure if we're going to get Pokemon that can guarantee Mega Evolve or have a Mega Stone available. Huh. I know when we go to the tower, uh, we get a guaranteed Mega and their Stone. Okay. Um, so, that should be alright. But after this, it could just be three random Mons. Or it could be stuff with a Mega Stone, but we will get the Blast, Blastoise, I, Charles, well, any of those. So we're not going to get the right Mega Stone, if it is. Oh, his second one's a Rampardos. No, what a pain in the ass. Right, I deal with my normal, and my Burmy has Tackle. Nah. Right, Rhyhorn only has normal type moves at this point, I think. And he has Stomp, Horn Attack, Sand Attack, something else. It won't have any ground or rock type moves, I don't believe. So oh, thank this. God. I thought Rampardos uh, was rock type. Rampardos? It is rock type, isn't it? Yes, yeah. And, and I've one shot it with, thankfully, Nummel knows uh, Magnitude. Ah, uh, nice. And it got Magnitude 9, so. Holy crap! Um, I just got. I think I just got red. Um. Sycamore withdrew um, Rhyhorn and sent out Lily. I'm not quite oh. sure what Lily has. Oh, it has Astonish, so it's super effective. But also, it's not Stab, so it's trash. But also, Sycamore this early in the game, switching our Mons. Yeah. That's that's not early game AI. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> e Heaven forbid if you had a Gengar or something. <laughs> Who is my Burmy linked to? The Mischievous. Okay. Why? It's fine. I was just I was considering <laughs> sending it out so I could heal Nummel and then hopefully switch back. But I'm just going to stick with Nummel and heal it itself. <laughs> Don't kill the Mischievous, please. <laughs> if I am ever in the position of losing either my Nummel or my Burmy, I am gonna lose Burmy. <laughs> <I mean, laughs> really? Why? <laughs> Tell who's, me why. <laughs> who's Nummel linked to? Nummel is linked to Scolipede, which is my carry okay. at the minute. Uh, back into Rhyhorn. So no! Oh! What? <laughs> Nummel survived on one HP! Stop almost killing my mons! <laughs> oh. Alright, I'm gonna have to switch into Burmy to heal up Nommel, otherwise it will die. Yeah, good lord. Yeah, if you <laughs> sack something, I'll sack off the Burmy. Oh, I can't believe it survived on one HP. Okay, right. If Nommel Just, hadn't I, I... leveled up to level 18 in the middle of this battle, that it would have been dead. Oh my god, yeah, it would have. <laughs> uh, right, before you sack off Burmy, I'm on the last Mon. I'm on the right one. I'm not necessarily <laughs> sacking off Burmy, by the way. Like, it... It, it may be fine. <laughs> God, and a Bronzong. Man, he, Oh, Bronzor, sorry. Oh, that's a... Sycamore has, a, team, has a big, like, fascination with uh, these rock types right now. It's Steel and Rock, isn't it? Or is it just Steel? Steel Psychic, isn't it? 
Still psychic. Yeah, that makes sense. Okay. Alright, I might be okay then. Depending on how normal takes this. Oh, lovely. Barely did anything. Uh, Yo, mobile mobile writer. Yo, I put that, I published the um, video and here. Like always, man is the first one on the video. Mobile <laughs> nice. writer. Nice. What a boy. <laughs> Absolute G. Uh, I smashed that bronze or one shot. Combi should be fine as well. I think I think it's going to be okay. I think this is his last one. Yeah, it okay, is. Well, I, I've just beat Sycamore, so we're good uh, on my end. So you just have to win. Cool. Callum. Yeah, Combi did like one HP. I'm fine. Cool, battle's right, one. I, lovely. Let's get some new. Oh, I got. I went out, and we, me and Hannah were in uh, Tesco, uh, just doing some shopping, and I went and bought a big old A4 booklet, a uh, notepad, so I don't have to write in all this in a crappy little A5 one. Nice. It's like specifically for this. Uh, it's Excellent. lovely and neat, and I thoroughly enjoy it. But hey, I could cross out Route oh, 4. Sorry, I. Because you killed it. I, I smashed through the A button and I'm on my starters now. Oh, oh wait, 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 don't, okay, here we are. So, uh, <laughs> I'm going to have to sack off a mon no matter what I pick, just so you know. So wait, we are so not going to have a third mon. Wait, so are these all types you have then? Yes. What are your mons? Tepig, Nuzleaf, and Fennekin. Two of them are actual Tep starters. <laughs> Tep um, we don't have a fire type. What about? I've got a number. Oh wait, Nummel's. Nummel's fire type. Tepig, Fennekin, and what's the other one? Nuzleaf. Grass. The thing is, Burmy sucks, so I'm leaning towards Burmy Nuzleaf. Yeah. Um, Which is like a second stage mon. Uh, I'm gonna but leaf I don't want to sack off your mischievous if... Well, I guess it's Mr. of Us or Scurlypede. What are your stars? Uh, a Deerling, no. Crabby and an Abra. So if I can switch train the Abra, have a Kadabra. That could be that could 16. be good. That could be huge. Just don't know. We can't organise trades through. You wouldn't even need to switch train it. Movement. We've got EXP share. Oh hell yeah! Um, but I'm also. I'm just gonna look when you get a Leaf Stone in this game because you can have a. Um, so I can tree. have a shift tree early um, on. Are items not randomised? Not field items. Excellent. So we're going in the core games. I thought they were. I thought all the stuff in... Um... The forest were random. No, I got... Like, all the ones you pick up in Pokeballs, they're all the same. So okay. I got, like, a potion and a paralyze heal. Um... So it would be either Route 8 or Lever City for a Leaf Stone. Yeah. I have no idea where we're going next. Um, and then. It's 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 basically. I I want to uh, pick Nuzleaf regardless because if I'm gonna lose, um, on I'd rather lose Burmy than than Nummel, especially because th Nummel's fairly high level now because of all the grinding. I think that our strongest pair is Nubble and Scoliopede, so I think it's definitely right yeah. not to pick. So I think should definitely go with Nuzleaf. Uh, I'm not going to choose Dealing, because I can't, because that's primary grass. Um, so it's Krabby or Abra. Like, Krabby is bulk, but Abra will be strong and fast. That's a tough one, because, yeah, both a Kingler and a Kadabra could be quite useful. Uh, is is there anything in this legitimate randomizer that allows you to get an Alakazam without trading? I don't think there is, you know. Not that that makes a huge difference, but it is just something I was thinking about. Um, what level does Krabby evolve? Like 28 or 32? Come on, I think around 28. I don't think it's as high as 32. I went to search Krabby and I came up with, did you mean Krabby Patty? No. <laughs> <laughs> um, uh, it evolves at level 28. 28. Uh, which is quite a long time to have a Krabby, but we are going to get so many more encounters. I mean, if it's... Yeah. I, I'm i not sure... And also, how, how long much... until Abra learns a useful move? It learns confusion when it evolves at level 16. Um, 
it's up to you then. I I personally think I'd pick Abra, but um, uh, I'll, I'll go with Abra. Your team. I'm gonna go with Abra because I used Abra. I used a Kadabra in Brilliant Diamond. So why That's not? fair. I picked Squirtle. I received Abra. So, what? <laughs> yeah, I just saw that as well. <laughs> I can't believe of those second starters. It gave me a fire and a grass type. The two types I have. Yeah, that's uh, absolutely screwed. Uh, Mr. Mr. Man. What? Why am I naming things things? Sure. So you decided his nickname will be Mr. Man. Yeah. Why not? Treat yourself. And the Blastoise Knight. The Blastoise Knight. Thanks. <laughs> my Nuzleaf is just called New Green. New Green. He's my New Green. Yes, Charizard <laughs> That will be very useful for my Nuzleaf. The thing is, if I actually got the Alakazite, that would be huge. Actually, it wouldn't because I can't get an Alakazam. <laughs> <laughs> Damn. We didn't think this through. Right, I'm just going to rattle through this text. Yeah. And then end the episode because we have about three minutes of... Oh yeah. Stuff as well. So it'll be about 33 minutes. Uh, buh, 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 buh. Okay, yes. Sycamore. Oh, he's got a lot to say, isn't he? Yep. And he shut up. Lovely. Excellent. Right. Right. Just do back to back episodes. Bang him out tonight. Let's just pew pew pew. Because me and Callum are up early in the morning for different reasons. Love. We're both having got work. A job. Um. <laughs> <laughs> uh, thank you very much for watching uh, we are back on the up potentially I mean we've still only got two mons but um, hey we smashed Sycamore who had six mons um, yeah thank you very much for watching again parts go up on mine and Will's channel interchangeably so after this episode the next one will be on Will's channel uh, if you're watching this later on and you want to catch up that's where you'll find the next episode um make sure you like subscribe hit the like button hit the notification bell do all that stuff so that you know when these new episodes hit your feed uh and will would you like to say anything to sign off ah uh, just did you know penguins do actually have kneecaps fun fact of the day oh now yeah. hmm. goodbye <laughs> enjoy that goodbye <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha!